Hey guys, welcome to another statue collection update. This is part 2 and today we are going to move some statues from the studios to my home and obviously some statues from home to the studio. But before all that, we are going to unbox something first. This is my very first omnibus that I bought. I got this from uh, Organic Price Comic Book. So shout out to JP who hooked me up with the comic books. You should check out their website since uh, their stuff are actually way cheaper than the stuff uh, sold at Amazon. So it's a pretty good deal. You can check the link below. That is a affiliate link. So if you want to buy some comics, you can use that link. So my channel, this channel would benefit a bit from uh, your purchase. So I'm just going to show you guys what I bought for the first Omnibus. There's a note here. Hey you, uh, JP here and well thanks for shopping with us. No problem. I got a coupon code for two dollars. No, it's not gonna bore you with that. I just want to show you guys uh, what's inside. It's actually quite heavy. <laughs> Oh, it has a bookmark. Looks like the X-Men, but it's not. Okay, so I bought the Venomnibus, as they call it. This is from the Venom run by Donny Cates. Uh, the King in Black is a part here, but I think there are a lot more. It's actually quite thick, almost two to three inches. Anyway, I'm not sure if I'm going to read this since I've already read the King in Black, which is uh, this one. Okay, so let's start removing some statues so we could bring them at home. So uh, what we are going to do is just we will bring these two statues, Grandi and the Magneto on throne since uh, most of my thrones and my Arkham villain are at home. As you can see, the two Wolverines up top are already displayed with the rest of my Wolverines with metal claws. And I don't think you've seen the unboxing of this one yet, which is the Prime 1 Age of Extinction Optimus Prime. These two I need to bring home, but not today. Only this stuff since they are already quite big. So this is how we are going to transport it. I'm not worried that much because my home is just less than five minutes drive away from the office. So Grandi is here. The uh, sentinel head from the throne is here at the back. And lastly is we have the throne and the base and foot for Grandi here. Okay, so let's move out. here we are at home so this is what the collection look like uh, now all the iron mans are in one area Hulk Buster obviously down here because uh, it's too heavy I think I've already shown you guys this before so this two surfer needs to go out and go to the studio since this is the only area where the magneto on throne would fit up here nothing new uh, obviously Nova is gone because I've sent him to the painter to uh, get repainted to be more blue instead of black. Okay, time to get these two surfers out. Okay, so uh, Magneto on Throne is here. He is on a very tight fit. As you can see, uh, the gap between him and Doctor Doom isn't much. And I would have wished that all of them are facing here, but 
uh, the display shelf isn't just deep enough on how massive the statue is. So he needs to be tilted to the side a bit. But the good thing is there's enough room here uh, for the sideshow Thanos on front that we will be moving since Grandi needs to be uh, where he is currently at. So we are going to the second floor. The camera uh, got a battery empty while we were moving statues back at home. What we were able to do is transfer Sideshow Thanos and Throne downstairs and install Grandi. We'll show you guys that uh, tomorrow on a different day but on the same video. But now uh, we're back at the studio. So I bought the two surfers I've got here. This one was the repainted one. Well, this one was the other one we unboxed, I think early this year. So I guess that's about it and I'll show you guys the update tomorrow on what's currently displayed at home. So we got a few boxes here that needs to be uh, moved to the studio. Actually, uh, as many as the boxes are here, this is actually just two statues and I don't even own one of them. So this is gonna be the custom Hulkbuster and hopefully we can upload the video next week. If not, then of course the following week. Okay, so that's it for this statue collection update. More on future videos. Hopefully we can move more of the statues here. Superman, hopefully we can make a better place for him. All the Avenger stuff or villains on one place. Even this uh, Venom behind me, hopefully we could find a better place for him. Hopefully we can do all that on the next episode. Anyway, this is Carl and see you in the next one.